what up YouTube rocks fanatic 17 coming at you with a video recap purchase of what I got from Ricky Russo um, in his purchase um, or in his for sale video I just tried making this video it ended up being like 15 minutes that's too long um, not that Ricky doesn't deserve the time Ricky does deserve the time but Ricky um, you know I'm gonna Ricky usually his videos are five minutes or less sometimes sometimes 10 minutes I'm gonna try and keep this 10 minutes or less for Ricky's sake um, for the rest of your sake too uh, so the first purchase I got is this Ruby uh, from Panini Flawless of Auto Porter numbered 5 of 15 so there's the back there my first Ruby or diamond card from any particular set so that's awesome Next up is this Magic Johnson uh, Flawless Achievements, All-Star uh, All Achievements uh, Auto Ruby from Flawless, numbered 11 to 15. Uh, this is a guy I've really been looking forward to adding to my collection. Been wanting to Magic Johnson Auto for a while. Definitely one of the best basketball players ever. So happy to add this to the collection. And speaking of adding somebody to the collection I really wanted, uh, wanted to, I cannot thank Ricky enough for helping me out. Um, and Ricky, I'm speaking directly to you, my friend, on here, thank you so much. I I very much appreciate you looking out for me, helping me add this guy to my collection. Um, I think you know that I've been wanting to add this guy for quite a while, and you made this possible. Um, and it is a rookie class of 1955 Ring Auto from Tops, numbered 1 of 10 of Sandy Koufax. That is just a gorgeous, gorgeous card. Ricky gave me a fantastic deal on it. Just beautiful. I ended up talking about this card for like seven minutes in my last video. Um, just I great addition to my collection. Uh, you know, I know in my last video I said, you know, I'm a fan of the Dodgers. Um, my dad's a fan of the Dodgers. I'm a big fan of Dodgers history. Um, so this is a piece of baseball history that I just absolutely love adding to the collection. That autograph. I mean, Sandy Koufax, just a fantastic player, one of the best pitchers ever. And honestly, as I've gotten older, i found that I'm more of a fan of baseball than simply just a specific team. Um, congratulations to the Cubs and the Indians, as that's going to be the World Series this year. So that's exciting. Two teams, the two teams with the longest World Series drought, are uh, going to be duking it out. So will the Cubs choke? Or will the Indians choke? What, what's going to happen? Find out. Um, and this card I did not pick up from Ricky. Um, this actually came on eBay the same day that I purchased those cards from Ricky. And uh, I sent this guy an offer. I didn't lowball him, um, but I really, uh, he had the card listed for way more than I wanted to pay, or I even thought was reasonable. So I sent him an offer, um, just trying to start negotiations. He actually accepted, so I paid a ridiculously low price for this. But this is from 2016 Tier 1, um, number 20 out of 50, and it is another Sandy Koufax autograph. So I now have two in my collection. Gorgeous cards. Just gorgeous. But that doesn't get a lot of screen time because I did not get it from Ricky. And the last um, thing I'm going to show you guys is the mystery pack. I already opened it because in the last video I was going through it and the video was just way too long. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I got. So this first one is a studio swatches of Danny Green from Studio, uh, from Gala. Studio swatches from Gala. Danny Green, the green parallel. I think it's funny. Number 44 of 60. So I'll do that. Next up from Sp Spectra is a Freshman Fabrics of Bobby Portis, blue. There's the back, number two of 35, the blue version. Um, I'm not going to, I want to give these cards the, the time on camera they deserve, so forgive me if this, I'm going to try to keep this, you know, keep it going, 
but you know, I want to give the cards a show as well. Uh, Boris da uh, do Dial, I guess is how you pronounce it. Da, I guess. I don't know. Red version from Totally Certified, numbered out of 199. Next up from Totally Certified, the red version of Tony Allen, game used jersey, numbered out of 199. Next up, a really nice Harrison Barnes from the same year, numbered out of 199. Next up from Immaculate, Michael Beasley, numbered out of 75. I'm not sure why that is purple. Oh, it says, the enclosed game war materials worn as a member of the Phoenix Suns are guaranteed uh, by Panini of America. That's cool. I wish, you know, I love Immaculate. Gorgeous product. I wish that Panini would get the baseball. Um, so you could get, I would just want Immaculate and Spectra baseball. I like Tops more than Panini, but God, could you imagine if they could do the logos with baseball? Those would be awesome. And Andre Jamin, numbered 1 of 99 from Lux. You know, and that's another thing, guys. You know, look at all the cards that I got. This was 25 bucks, but I mean, look at the products that these are coming out. These are high end products. Uh, James Harren. I don't say the D because he has no D. So, James Harren. Phenoms. Next is this tie dye die cut from select which is just gorgeous select is another gorgeous product this is numbered out of 25 numbered 16 of 25 so a die cut from mr david west next we have an alex len auto from totally certified numbered uh out of 49 16 of 49 i'm not really sure what the what parallel or what um like if that's a refractor i can't tell Next, totally, cer uh, totally certified fabric of the games, TJ Warren of the Suns, numbered out of 99. Next up, another Alex Len refractor, prism, whatever, numbered out of 60 from Gala. Another nice, really, a really nice swatch there. Number five overall in the 2013 draft. Another immaculate card, Ch nice Chandler Parsons for Dallas, and a, the throwback uniform at that. Love those old Mavericks uniforms. This is number forty-four of seventy-five. Immaculate standard, Chandler Parsons. Next up is a Kelly Dubry Jr. Jumbo fabric of the game relics from Totally Certified, numbered out of 199 and again guys remember i paid a dollar i mean uh 25 bucks for this and look at what i'm getting definitely of uh, ricky is just the most generous guy i know don't know really anybody else that that helps uh helps us out in the hobby like he does jordan mickey uh blue parallel rookie fabric of the game from certified this one's numbered out of 99 Next is the Jumbo Red version of Joe Young, Mighty Joe Young. This one is also numbered out of 199. Oh, these cards aren't going in correctly. There we go. Next up is a blue fabric of the game of Kyle Korver for the Hawks. Numbered out of 49. And Kyle Korver is if uh, one of the best shooting guard or one of the best guards. One of the best shooting guards in the game. Um, I mean, definitely maybe the second best three-point shooter. And I think he gets overshadowed because of Steph Curry. But he is just a fantastic three-point shooter. Next is this Luau Dang. Fabric of the game, red. Numbered out of 99. This Rajon Rondo, 
blue parallel. And it says there he wore that when he was with the Celtics. So 1899. I've never understood, though, why Panini does that, um, where they have them in one uniform and then has the, like, jersey from another. I mean, it, it's a minor complaint. I just I don't really understand the point to that. Comment below and let me know what you think about that, too. I'd be interested to know if I'm the only one that thinks that. The last one is a really nice Yao Ming from Totally Certified. Yao. This one's numbered out of 99. So that was my mystery pack. Ricky, again, thank you so much for, you know, all that you do, I uh, you know just really appreciate it. Thanks for hooking me up with these uh, with these sick cards. Um, just I mean, fantastic additions to my collection. Um, so yeah, guys, I went over ten minutes. I apologize, but that is definitely this is definitely faster than my last one. So hope you guys are enjoyed the video. Uh, good luck with your pack breaks and purchases, TTMs, and all that stuff. And I'll talk with you guys later. Peace.